Educational videos on biogas by Hikans. Welcome back after two sessions. The third session we thought that we'll cover on bank financing part because many of our entrepreneurs are actually dependent on the bank loan. So there may be uh, people who are financing it on the equity basis or any other basis. So um, I would say 99% of the CBG uh, finance happens through banks. So we are part of uh, Icons uh, Bioenergy. Uh, we are under uh, Satat, we are approved one of the technology providers. We are members of Indian Federation of Green Energy. And our technology is approved by Indian Institute of Science and Agarkar Research Institute in Pune. Coming back to the subject, uh, there are CBG specific lending options floated by the bank like SBI, Kendra, uh, Bank of Baroda, Union Bank and Ireda. Out of this Ireda finances so all the renewable uh, project uh, only, a bit solar, wind and uh, CBG. But they have very few uh, branches and access points for the customer. Other than these uh, banks which are having the CBG specific policies, the generic all other banks can lend on a national biofuel policy or just as a MSME loan. How the technicality of the bank uh, works is, uh, let us say you are a, a normal entrepreneur without any uh, special uh, what you call category status or uh, special links in the system. So you your project cost is one rupee then you are going to put 30 paisa from your own hand as an owner's contribution then 70 paisa bank is going to finance and for financing this project they will typically expect another 50 percent of value as their security holding if the project cost is one they want a coverage of 150 percent so that is what is generally uh, extended to most of the public uh, people in India. So what it means is we'll uh, see how that works. Now in a project uh, we are uh, you are putting 30 rupees. Plant and machinery cost is say 100. So I'm telling in terms of the security value holding basis for the bank. Project land is costing let us say 50 rupees. So on the day one of your project, bank is holding a value which is 150 rupees, right? So they are comfortable to lend it to you. The scenario two is you are putting this 30. This is non-excusable. So that will keep on going. The plant and machinery 100. Uh, that is also the entire plant and construction, whatever you are doing. Project land, let us say it is only 20 rupees. Then you have to give a additional say, collateral security, which is land of worth 30 rupees so then also what will happen bank will hold this much assets and they are covered 150 percent security the scenario three is margin money you are putting 100 is the uh, machinery value project land is uh, uh, 20 then there is no additional collateral security for you if the bank manager decides at his own discretion, he can give you an option of utilizing the CGT MSC, which is a capital guarantee trust, which holds a lot of money to support Indian entrepreneurs who are not able to give this additional security. Actually, the uh, task of this organization is, but this is at the discretion of the bank manager, or you can call it at the mercy of the bank manager. Now, uh, then the total security they will hold is. 150 so it, it is in the hands of the manager so scenario four is let us say you are a new entrepreneur and you don't have much money or cash flow in hand then it is always a better idea to make your company along with somebody who is having a good cash flow so then what happens bank is comfortable financing you scenario five is very straightforward you are running an existing business and you want to diversify and based on the a value of value of the asset in the existing business or based on the cash flow the bank can uh, finance you other than this uh, there are so many mudra loan shishu kishore startup india stand up india all those things are they are extending very small amount of loan and this is not at all suitable for any cbg kind of project these are all designed for satisfying the mass needs not for a uh, large project like uh, of cbg 
so finally in any banking sector uh, what we have to realize is uh, it is uh, whatever is written on the policy uh, it is highly subjective and it can change from manager to manager bank to bank location to location so it is uh, finally uh, the good networking based on through which you will be uh, decided whether you are worthy of taking the loan or not taking the loan this is what is the uh, practical guide on getting a cbg loan and this holds good for uh, all the normal cases and if you keep aside some additional cost of uh, financing and there will be delays and you can tackle all those things by uh, uh, employing a good consultant between you and the bank it is just like taking the driver license so uh, when there is a consultant they will be able to handle the loan better thank you